Hello guys, welcome to my channel, Love to Learn. In our today's video, I want us to look at something that has been affecting all of us. And these are the effects of global warming. Where I am right now, it has been very, very sunny for a prolonged period of time. And I want us to just look at some things we can do to ease this pain because for sure it's been hot. Number one, keep hydrated. Thank you. Water is life. So please pack your water as you go to your working place. Pack water for your children as they go to school. Carry water in every uh, activity that you want to engage in. Don't come out of that house without water. Why? Because most of the time I say that maybe I will pick water along the way as I go. Or um, maybe I'm going to town and I say at a point I will buy a bottle of water. But let me tell you, you keep postponing the thought and you find that the whole day has just passed without you buying that bottle of water. So I see it very important and very crucial if you could just pack your water from home. And of course, you are well satisfied with your water. It's clean and it's ready for you. So this is a very important point. Number two, wear comfortable clothes. And when I say comfortable, I mean well-fitted clothing, not very tight. And here we can invest in cotton materials. At this time, uh, I feel that cotton are very friendly to the skin and they can absorb even the extra sweat if you engage in an activity that will make you sweat. So a cotton uh, material clothing will absorb this sweat and you will feel very comfortable compared to some materials like this is the... Um, silk is it silk chiffon chiffon materials such such materials can uh, I'm, I'm very sure they cannot absorb and they are embarrassing so cotton material is also good for babies you will never find um or experience a baby rush if you invest in cotton clothing materials for your small baby and another thing I want to say is about shoes. Always make sure you wear well-fitted shoes. And, you know, I don't know why, but I find that in this hot weather, as the day goes by, you find that your legs are swollen. I'm not very sure, but um, you can just tell me in the comment section below what happens. But you feel a pinch at around 2. Too. Eh? For the full for the whole morning you are comfortable, but as time goes by you feel pinched eh? and you feel so uncomfortable. There's nothing so soaring like a, a painful, you know, uh, shoe experience. And uh, you can wear canvas maybe or sporty comfortable shoes. This is very important and it will make your day uh, continue on very well you can also avoid the sandals because I see that when we have this very sunny weather uh, most of the time it is accompanied with uh, maybe a dusty period and especially for countries like here in Africa where it is not all carpeted so you experience this dusting dusty period so I think when you have covered your legs well, it's very important you don't have to experience those cracked heels and all the dust uh, everywhere. Number three is um, you can wear sunscreen. And sunscreen is very important to everyone. I didn't say lady to ladies, but I say to everyone. And especially when you... Coming out of that house, make sure you have sunscreen on you. 
uh, this will prevent illness like skin cancer where you stay for prolonged periods on the sun uh, also you can avoid sunburn when you use sun sunscreen or sunblock this is what I use aloe sunscreen so you can also use any sunscreen that you find fit for you and I know there are people who cannot even access or uh, maybe afford sunscreen but I have seen some creams face creams which are not costly but you find that they have sunscreen in them so as you buy this skin product it is good to buy uh, something that is natural and something that will help you uh, this my this one has a uh, an SPF of 30 and I, I know others have SPF of 50 it all depends on how long you're going to stay on the direct sun light and sunglasses this is to prevent your eye nowadays you can see sunglasses all over the market so when buying sun glasses for sun protection make sure they they have the sun block in them that is very very important because you see somebody with uh, sunglasses it, uh, it's a costume at that time and the other thing we can do is to engage in activities that are fit for that weather and uh, number one activity is swimming so if you get time just uh, be happy, uh, grab that costume and just enjoy your time in the swimming pool because soon enough the rains are coming and uh, uh, the weather will change like last year we experienced so prolonged period of cold weather and you could not do anything to do with swimming unless maybe you are, you are swimming on a warm swimming pool which are not so common so let us enjoy every weather that comes around you don't have to sulken it's hot it's cold no enjoy that period because um that period will come to an end and the only thing we can do is to just live our life to the fullest you don't have to, to keep complaining it's like this it's like this no grab the opportunity do the activities that keep you happy and all will be well this is also a time to enjoy wear your brightest colors because we see that bright colors it reflect they don't absorb um the heat so they they reflect so they are cotton yes uh but you can invest in beautiful colors orange yellow white we are those um what are they called these are the shirts and the summer dresses yes they come in so dif uh, different and colorful colors and this is the time to enjoy it the hats are so so beautiful uh, on ladies and they have a purpose they cover your your whole area uh, face area and you also look very charming in those hats so let us enjoy just share in the comments section below right now what are the other activities that we can do to ease or what can we do to ease this period and to make our day beautiful and worth living continue subscribing and let this channel grow guys bye thank you for watching this video i love you